Mania. And of course, uh, we'll pull up. Uh, Matt, wake up! Oh no, oh no, we lost Matt again. We lost Matt again. Uh -oh. Hold on, Matt, you're there with the board! Hey! Hey! Uh, how long was I out? Uh, let's see, we talked about, about impact. a minute of impact. Yes. Did, um, did Madonna win the Divas title? Yes. Yes. So it wasn't a dream. <laughs> uh, hey, everybody. Hi. <laughs> Sword? Scott, was that your Bobby F. J. Town impression? <laughs> no, if it was his Bobby F. J. Town impression, he would have said Calculon's back. Oh. Where uh, can I put Chappie? Mayhem Mania. <laughs> welcome to Mayhem Mania. It's kind of a competitive thought experiment where we create the best WrestleMania card possible using only wit and shenanigans. Mm -hmm. We have eight matches here on the table. We've got six people who will make one move to change this card, either by swapping out one wrestler for another, getting rid of one match for another, trading guys in between matches. You'll see. Most of these guys know the score. It's lots mm -hmm. of fun. Mm -hmm. Where was I? Let's recap the card, Sorg. Let me stress to everyone, first and foremost... We are not trying to predict, predict what WWE is going to do. So as much as that WrestleMania, that terrible WWE machine that LB is always talking about, as much as that terrible machine and the inertia is driving you so, toward certain things and certain decisions, I want you to fight it. Fight that WrestleMania card because you're making your own WrestleMania card. We're making a Mayhem Mania card, a better WrestleMania card, the WrestleMania card you deserve. And here's what we got. Okay. Uh, first, let's take let's all celebrate the uh, the match that graduated mm -hmm. uh, to permanence. The Miz versus Damian Miz now, which, which will not be happening at WrestleMania. Hey. <laughs> that will not <laughs> be happening at this year's WrestleMania. But it should. It should have. And here's the rest of the eight. Here's the eight <laughs> matches that we have after last week's round. The day with Tommy versus Daniel Bryan. Triple H versus Sting. John Cena versus Roman Reigns versus The Rock. Charlotte, Char Char, as I like to call her, versus oh. Sasha Banks. I can't believe you guys talked for that. <laughs> Rusev versus Brock Lesnar. The Usos versus Kid and Cesaro versus The Big Show and Kane versus Dean Ambrose and Seth Rollins in a four way tag team match. Gold <laughs> Dust versus Stardust. Hold on, pause. Wait, just one more. Pause, pause. You run that. Sure, we'll be happy to, uh, AJ. Let me just mention real quick here at the bottom, Finn Balor versus Trey Wyatt. Now, this one here, you might be wondering, what the hell happened? Well, the Usos versus Tyson Kidd and Cesaro versus The Big Show and Kane versus Dean Ambrose and Seth Rollins. Any questions, AJ? Uh, no, that was the one. I just needed to hear that one again. Right, Let it go. sink in. <laughs> and of course, Let I'll, that oh. for just a minute. Oh, I have a rule for this week. Uh oh. I have a rule for this week. It's kind of a punishment, but you guys <laughs> probably won't mind too much. But last week, like all of you guys were picking NXT guys, and you know I love NXT guys too. But dude, be serious. All right. <laughs> no NXT guys this week. No, no, no. NXT guys this no. week. Bring me an NXT guy no. and you'll be gone. Damn it. I was going to replace The Rock with TJ Parker so quick. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so no Mojo Raleigh. No, no, save your oh. move for next week. It's only a one week ban. Wow. You guys need to be, also, cool. to be cooled the F off. Also, Matt Carter. What's his name? Put a Hideo with Tommy into the match. I was like, we're not doing NXT, guys. Okay, uh, Matt Garland. Are any of these matches after this round of voting, would they advance to uh, permanent spots? I kind of like to keep that secret so it could be a surprise, but since you asked, I'll tell you. Um, you don't, you can't even a secret. None of these <laughs> matches are going to graduate if okay, they survive this week. Okay. These are yeah. all so fresh. The, the most some of these have been on here is like for like A rounds, so they got to get going. If they survive three rounds, they graduate to permanence, the super card, if you will. Wow. Let's get down to business. All right. Bad Mike, you're up. 
<laughs> yeah, Mad Mike, you're up. Sorgatron is on the deck. All right. I am changing a match. I am re I am taking one match out and replacing it with another. Okay. Very good. I am taking out Bray Wyatt versus Finn Balor. Aww. Are you doing that because the pr the intros would last six times longer than the match itself? Oh no, because I feel AJ's going to be eating a lot of wings on WrestleMania, and he needs his Undertaker shit break, and the Undertaker right, is not I booked do. for this card. So we're going to uh, have the Undertaker uh, versus Sheamus. Oh, wow. <laughs> so it's a ghost versus a ghost. Yes. Oh, you kind of screwed, screwed me up there. Huh. I can't. I can't. I can't swap. Nice to see Sheamus on the card. I can't mm -hmm. swap wrestler for wrestler, can I? Like, like yeah. from match to match. Sure, you can. Like yeah, I can. Yeah. Like I can flip like, two matches, kind of. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can have up two matches at the same time, Sorg. Yeah, I know you guys the are. Swap, the I'm, swap is uh, is definitely okay. I I, um, I kind of want. You're on deck. Oh man, because I was going to. I was going to completely just uh, just go ahead and make Sting and Undertaker happen, uh, <laughs> just for the hell of it. Because I just like Let's as do much because I like as much black in my uh, in my wrestling match at WrestleMania as possible. So, um, ah man, uh, but that, that from the from the chat room, uh, Riz is saying. Fuck you, fuck you hard. Oh, I feel sick. I feel really sick. <laughs> but then, then we're gonna get Triple H. So Riz is, loves my match. So because then we're gonna get like Sheamus versus Triple H. If I can do a swapperoo there. Yeah. So. Hey, WrestleMania 26 rematch. Why and, not? But I kind of like the idea. What it was Taker and Sheamus, right? Like, mm -hmm. So now yeah, I just want to Sheamus. Now I just want to do something damaging to to Sting and Triple H just for the hell of it. Um, <laughs> How, uh, mm, okay, so somebody who could potentially come back, uh, the guy I think about is going to be a long shot, because I don't think he can officially, officially come back, but I feel like it's inevitable one day. <laughs> is, does that count? <laughs> uh, within the realm of reality, if it gets too controversial, we'll let the panel vote. Is Stone Cold Steve Austin controversial? Yes. Um, okay. Sorg, how no. about Randy Orton? No, no, I'm not picking Randy Orton for anything. Let's be. Wait, no. wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm just saying he's not on the card. That's all. Wait, wait, hold, hold on. Let's put it to a voice vote. Do you guys believe Stone Cold Steve Austin is within the realm of reality? No. no. Yes. No. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's, 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 that's Flair and Shawn Michaels on the card at one point. <laughs> that's true. They're, that's true. They're able-bodied. That is true. Rick we're Flair not sure is about, always a possibility. We're not sure about Stone Cold. Wait, where's Cena? Just, Cena's in that crap match, right? Yeah, Cena's in that three-way crap match. Um, Don't you do it. Sorry. What? Don't you do it. <laughs> I just want somebody better for Sting or Undertaker. But I How about Jericho? Uh, ooh. That's the opposite. Ooh, you're, you're influencing me. <laughs> uh, Sting versus Jericho? God, there that is could a be fun. bone sound sad enough for that match. You know what, I'm just, I'm guys? I'm just trying to think of guys who aren't on the card. You know what? All. I think this is within the realm of possibility. I might be stretching it slightly, but I think it's been proven that it could be. Ricky Steamboat. Versus? Sting. <laughs> wow. Okay. I gotta, you know what? That's not terrible because we saw we saw Steamboat, what was that, the year that he wrestled with Snuka and Piper yep. against Jericho? Yep. And Steamboat had like three or four matches like right around like Mania. What? It was fantastic. Three, four I'd years rather, I would say Ricky Steamboat is more plausible than Stone Cold Steve Austin. <laughs> yeah. That's correct. AJ, you are not the only drunk person here. <laughs> I would rather see Listen, Steamboat versus Steve, Brian. Austin's got, Austin's got two bad knees and, and wrestled more recently. Steamboat has wrestled more recently than Austin. That is true. That's true. That this is true. And also, Austin has, said repeatedly, Austin has said repeatedly that he's not going to wrestle. Yeah. Yeah. No. It's not going to do it. So I, I could see them bringing back Steamboat for a match. All right. So w this has to be completely in the realm of possibility, or is this just uh, like I can make up whatever? Yeah, but, like? but keep a lid on your brain for a second there, AJ. You're on deck. Eamon, you're up right now. Okay, I have an idea. I think I know what I'm I, I think I had an idea of knowing what I'm going to do with mine, so I'm just going to do it. Uh, the four-way tag's becoming a tag match. It's just Usos and Ken Bizarro. 
Can he act too like that? Well, um, you know what? What, oh, what we can say question. is that. But well, it does get a little bit complicated because we could we just be saying that they're that he's taking out this entire match and replacing it with. Can I match? Can you yeah, state I it so, when yeah. you take okay. out a match? You on, have to on, bring in a match with completely different people. So technically, I shouldn't allow him to just. Technically, ask I can't do that. You okay, are. Well, I have another idea. But you are you changing. Can, you trade one of these guys out of this match into something else. No, because like, my, my someone thing, comes in behind you and cleans up the mess. No, because my thing was that I really didn't want it to be a four way, but that's okay. Uh, I'm gonna go with a match that I made and then Bobby fucked up. <laughs> uh, before you had the chance to advance, uh, take out Hideo with Tommy and put in Dolph Ziggler. All right, good deal. All right, all right. We're all right, the- hold on. I have a question. If we have Bobby on next week and he just takes out Ziggler, Bobby, Bobby, Bobby. hey Bobby, no. <laughs> Bobby, I don't care what version of you is going to be choosing in this mayhem <laughs> minute. You're not fucking with that match. I really hope it's Ronda FJ Town. <laughs> We didn't, wrong, we, we didn't record that for gold. No one gets the joke now. I don't care. Oh, not don't, even the care. Patreon guys. <laughs> don't make the Patreon then. Fine. Hey, two of them. They're in the chat room. Two of them were here for it, so that's okay. The, the feed was down. <laughs> but two of them were in the right. hangout, so. But yeah, that's my pick. All right, who's next? AJ, you're up. Garza's on deck. Right. I have to be entirely honest. When you listed all the matches out, I was actually quite happy. You know, it had just been like, that's that's the card. Uh, but now that we've ruined it, uh, <laughs> can I? <laughs> um, I I want this, and I know this is not. I need to ask this question. This is another inside the realm of possibility. Can I get Dean Malenko? No. Uh, no. Dean's no. pretty messed up, isn't he? Yeah, I think so. Hmm. I, I will say this: this is this is what I would have done. Uh, I would have added Malenko to that Brian Ziggler match, <laughs> and I would have just Jeez. just just took my taken my pants off and just let my flag fly uh, <laughs> for a technical wrestling bonkers match. But we're not going to get that because you guys think it's not going to happen. Mm-hmm. Um. <laughs> oh. oh. I'm dying of fire. I, there, Who? There's not enough. Wh- Taker and Sheamus can die in a fire. Take that match out. Oh. God damn it. Wow. Uh-uh. No, that match would be terrible. Uh, uh, I'll replace that with. I will leave. Yeah, I have to take it out. So I'm taking that match out and I have to replace it with two people. I would like to see. I would like to see Bray Wyatt versus Luke Harper. Oh, okay. Really, a SmackDown mid card match? <laughs> I would like to see that match in a in a larger setting where they're not on fucking SmackDown. And Taker versus Chicken Meat is not what I want to watch. <laughs> Sorry, I can't do it. <laughs> well, good I luck trying to think of shit during this mania then, AJ. Okay? I was trying to help you out. <laughs> no, I, listen, I, listen, I now have the WWE Network. I can watch mania on my phone. I want to poop and watch. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need a um, poop break. <laughs> By the way, I, uh, whoever put Rusev versus Lesnar in uh, is a goddamn genius because that match just – has German suplexes <laughs> all day long in it. <laughs> I, I, I can check that. I'll, I'll find out. Someone, someone can click on the uh, on the uh, on the mainstream Matt blog and figure out who created that match because I forget because uh, this thing's turned into a blur. Um, all right, Garza, you're up. LB's on deck. Right. Well, there's a match that it's bothering me so much because you have two Samoans against an American, so. Roman Reigns and Rock versus, uh, well, Roman Reigns versus The Rock versus, I don't like this, uh, Two Samoans versus Tina. So I'm going to future of the WWE. And, uh, what did he say? I don't know. <laughs> what did he say? Oh, that's awesome. Know. And um, I believe it was Eamon that made the Rusev Brock Lesnar match. Bless you, Eamon. Thank you. 
Garza, what was your? What right, were you have to say it again. You glitched out. Oh, sorry. Uh, so Wait. Before yeah. you continue, <laughs> I would like to re- remind you. I, this is this is your first time of Mayhem Mania, and I want your decision to count and go through and be important. I'm going after you, and that matches my baby. <laughs> <laughs> but LB, he's our boss. LB, Mayhem Mania. LB, I know, I know you're a John Cena fan, and you can't be like you can't agree with Roman Reigns and Rock teaming up against uh, Cena like in the match. So we need to make this. A fatal four-way. That's oh, why I want to add. I want to add Alex Ryan. Oh, son of a bitch! <laughs> the of the Alex Riley. <laughs> not, not to spoil things, guys, but that's in the realm of possibility. Oh no! The decision oh, God stands. Damn it, Amen. The decision stands. Yes. <laughs> Amen. I'm Don't sorry. say not to spoil things that is and then spoil things. To be into it. <laughs> they have, the listeners have fair warning. Wow. Huh. Okay. Pay to his face, goddamn. Why did, okay. put, why did we put Alex Riley in the Miz Miz down match before it went permanent? Oh, man. <laughs> oh, no. No, it's a horrible idea. <laughs> Is oh, and this, and this well, is better. At least we know who's taking the pinfall in this four-way match. <laughs> <laughs> Alex uh, Riley in the R Truth role. Um, all right, LB. What kind of hell do you have to rot on this thing? It's tough now. It's tough. It's nearly perfect. I <laughs> really can't see anything I would change. Well, here's the problem. This four-way tag match has been pissing me off since whoever made it. And it's got to die. It's a son of a bitch. I just don't like anybody in this match as tag teams. Really? Yeah. I spend like, most of my like time fantasy booking how Ambrose and Rollins become a team in this match. <laughs> That's how I spend most of my day. <laughs> I, feel like, I feel like those two teaming up is a step backwards, and I'm very sorry, but no, I like Cesaro more as a singles competitor. I know it's an unpopular opinion, but it is my opinion. Now, Sork said something earlier that I thought was interesting. Oh, what did I do? You you ah. mentioned a match with The Undertaker and I think it was Sting, right? And you said, I want to get as much black as possible in this match. And didn't actually mention any black guys. No, I meant the outfits. <laughs> oh, wow. I know what you meant. I know what you meant, but you got my gears turning. And I started looking at the card that we have made here, and not a lot of black guys. There's a black female. Got Samoans. There's a, a, fuck you. <laughs> New day. <laughs> There are people painted with black. There are Samoans, which are, funnily enough, not, not black. black people. <laughs> <laughs> and then we have Sasha Banks, who, who does a great job. Now, I, I do feel that there needs to be a tag team. So we're going to have um, – let's have New Day. Let's have all three oh, New Day. I, I thought Matt was – Matt went to put a heart in Sasha Banks. I thought he was just going to write, is black. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, now he's doing it. It's happening. Man, we need some diversity on this show. Don't don't put that on the block. It would not be a good idea. Internet's forever, Eamon. All right. (laughs) Okay, so we're going to have a new day? Yeah. Yeah, this is being recorded and distributed. All all three of them. Versus, hold on, did Sheamus, did that Sheamus match get dissolved? So he got yeah. this thing, right? Good. This good. Yeah. Right. Versus Sheamus. And, uh, uh, shit, I'm blanking on his name. Uh, Jack Swagger. Oh. And Christian. <laughs> the three. Oh, well, hey, I, don't know what, I don't think Christian's in the realm of possibility. Didn't he get hurt? I think he's like permanently hurt. What do to about everyone? Everyone who I, says Christians in the realm of possibility say yay, nay, yay, uh, yay! Because I'm gonna kill this match next week anyway. Kidding. <laughs> oh, it's not looking good. I'll, I'll allow it. it. But you better yeah. watch yourself, McCoy. No, Christian, <laughs> Christian's fine. He's in the video game. 
<laughs> he's, yeah, I mean, he's, is not reality, Mike. He's listed on the superstars page of the WWE, whatever. Is he really? Yeah, yeah. he is. Hmm. Wearing gear, not even wearing a suit. That's weird. All right, yes or no on Christian, one more time. Yes or no on Christian, Christian yes. now? Yes. yes. I'll say yes, then fine. Right. The three whitest white guys I can think of on the roster. There you go. Christian. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Christian. Uh, well, no, you you got you got no 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 you got two white guys and a potato. No, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait, Matt, Matt, does it take a turn to put Paige in their corner? Oh. Sorry, no NXT guys this week. I mean, um, yeah, I guess we could. <laughs> what? Well, what? Fuck you, then. She's the main roster. <laughs> um, Sorg, that may come into play in a later round. Oh, okay, okay. Let me recap the uh, ba, ba, ba. and then I just have one more thing to tell everybody about next week. Okay. I think you're gonna love it. All right, let's recap the card real quick, Sorg. Okay. This is what Mayhemania looks uh, like after okay. round six. Bye. Miz versus Mizdow. Dolph Ziggler versus Daniel Bryan. Ricky the Dragon Steamboat versus Sting. John Cena versus Roman Reigns versus The Rock versus Alex Riley. Charlotte like versus Sasha Banks. <laughs> Rusev versus Brock Lesnar. Love that match, too. The New Day versus Seamus, Jack Swagger, and Christian. Goldust versus Stardust. And finally, Bray Wyatt versus Luke Harper. That's got pre-show written all over it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> not New so Day versus you. White Jobbers. <laughs> not New Not <laughs> literally no. Black Jobbers. No, 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 no. Not Black Jobbers versus White Jobbers. That's <laughs> nope. That not not six dudes who would be in a battle royal if they had one. <laughs> nope, <none of> <laughs> <laughs> um, so I promised you that I'd book this in reverse, so I've got something good for every week from here on in. Okay. Um, it's a good opportunity for me to tell AJ and Garza that uh, as Patreon subscribers, you will both be granted special privilege in an upcoming round. Mm -hmm. um, and I'll give you the details on that at a later time, but I wanted to give other people a chance to jump in because if someone was the last minute get in on the Patreon, maybe they could Appreciate take advantage of the it. privilege as well. Uh, do what I do. Week. Put your money where your mouth is and donate money to Patreon, and then you can do things like three minutes before the show say you want to be on it. <laughs> I don't know how scalable this is going to be if we get a lot of Patreon support. It's going to be greatly <laughs> scalable. I promise. Okay, okay. We might have to put certain limitations if we get to a certain point. <laughs> no, we don't. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, one more thing. Next week, we're going to introduce... For one week only, something very exciting. I don't have a jar, an actual jar, so I just have this bowl, but it's going to be called a jar. One of the six participants next week will be randomly selected to choose a name from the jar of mid-carters. And they will be forced to place this mid-carter onto the card for Mayhem Mania. So I, I love fun. It. Just for fun, I'm going to draw a name for you, Sword. This isn't for realsies, but we'll just do it for fun. So we'll, is, we'll, If this was on. happening, it Sword, could look like this. I want like you to this. be like, Sword, you've been randomly selected to pick from the jar of mid -carters. Are you ready? I'm ready. This is going to be me fantasy booking. Yeah. Oh, dude. Axelvania. If I get Axel, this is actually how they book Raw. the fucking Fulman Carters that they pull out from time to time. Congratulations, Sorg. You drew Fandango. Oh, what's up, Sting versus Fandango? Fandango versus Sting. Yep. Yes. I also love that Matt just has Legos in his house now. With mid carters just drawn on the sharpie. <laughs> I just want to let my kids. I want to let my kids know I, I did this with scotch tape. So oh, damn it! Damn it! Yeah, that's, that's, no, 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 no. That's the dad move. When you're a dad, you get to have like random stuff. Like I could probably do this with um like Hot Wheels cars. I have that. I got that level of, of car <laughs> game. Put a little tape, little tape underneath the car, right? In yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Wow. We do what we have to do. Wow, mainstream, Matt. Everybody. 
at Mainstream Matt on the Twitters, one T, uh, MainstreamMatt.blogspot.com. Uh, Matt, I hope that you don't have anything uh, lewd on your blogspot as they just changed the uh, the terms of service over there as well. I can't remember. <laughs> it's time to go look at the archives. Well, guys, <laughs> hey, let's um, take a second and find out what you guys learned from wrestling this week. But first, hey, you know, a lot of people actually um, responded to us. We were putting a question out early today on Twitter and on Facebook for Wrestling Mayhem Show and at Mayhem Show on Twitter. Uh, first of all, our new Patreon supporter, Buddy Landell, our first executive producer, he is pledging $5 an episode of the Wrestling Mayhem Show. Oh, man. Yes. God dang. He's stepping it up at the $5 Listen. level. You get some extra uh, be oh, fringe Landell benefits cheese. there. Uh, you get the super, super secret email that you guys don't get. Um, that I have to start making now because somebody's on paying the for show it. and we don't get this email. No, they don't nope, get this I email. Do. It's great. Nope, it's they a don't great get email. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but he says, "What did he learn?"